Here's the question. How do I use the grades in the Moodle gradebook to figure out midterm grades? I downloaded the Moodle grades into a spreadsheet, but they don't make sense. Well, here's an answer. You can set up the Moodle gradebook to accumulate scores and track student progress throughout the course. Or, you can calculate totals outside of Moodle by downloading or exporting the course grades in different formats. To download or export your grades, within your course, navigate to the Settings block. Click on Grades, and choose Export, either from the Settings block or from the page itself. For this example, the instructor has exported the grades as an Excel spreadsheet. When you open a spreadsheet in Excel, it may open as protected or read-only file, and your computer security settings may require you to click the Enable Editing button in the yellow bar at the top of the screen. Save the file with a new name for your own use. In this case, the instructor has named the file Grades for Calculating Midterm. Makes sense. I have deleted the students' names for this exercise. First, I'm going to reformat the sheet so I can see everything on one screen. I will select the entire sheet by clicking in the top left corner, modify the width of a column, and all the columns will be modified. Then I will wrap the text on the top line to read the column headings. Looking at this, we can see that columns C through Q should contain points from the quizzes, forums, and the midterm. And column R should be the course total. But you can tell that column R is not truly a sum of numbers from column C through column Q. So let's check that the calculation is correct. Clicking in cell R2, and looking up at the formula bar, we can see that the information in R2, rather than being a sum, is simply a number. That's how it was copied from Moodle. Let's change that to a formula that adds the points in columns C through Q. Don't forget, in spreadsheets we use the information location rather than the raw data when we write formulas. So click in R2, use the formula shortcut in the editing group, or just type in the formula, equals sum, parentheses, C2, colon, Q2, close parentheses. Press the Enter key. The first student has made it easy for us to check the accuracy of our formula. Is the information in cell R2, point A3, the sum of the points in cells C2 through Q2? Yes. So let's copy that formula through the rest of our sheet. Select cell R2, which contains the formula. Grab the tiny handle at the bottom right of the cell and you can tell that you've grabbed it when your cursor changes to a plus sign. Left-click, hold, and drag that formula to fill the rest of the column. Column R now contains the student raw score, or the sum of all points. In this class, the total points that a student could have received is 49. So the percentage will be the number of points divided by 49. In column S, we will put a formula to calculate the percentage for each student. So in cell S2, the formula will be equals R2 divided by 49. Press the Enter key. Let's decrease the decimal places to 2 and copy the formula throughout the rest of the column. Now you have percentages for each student at midterm. 
Moodle can do all of this for you. And that's a different answer video.